Today, we visit Dollywood in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee for the first time ever on Tom Was Here. Hello out there, wherever you are. As for me, I am here at Dollywood, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. This is my first time going to this park, uh, and I'm very curious to see. Um, you know, I've heard a lot of great things about it. Uh, I'm a big fan of Dolly, both in pop culture and in real life. She's awesome, um, but definitely wanted to check this park out. I've heard only good things. I've heard amazing things about the food, amazing things about the rides. So we are gonna explore Dollywood for the first time ever. Let's go. All right, we are in. We're here at Dollywood. Stepped inside the candy emporium here because it is a little toasty outside. Just a bit warm. Blue raspberry twist. Ooh, let me grab a nose later. It's very nice in here. Very cool. Uh, Dolly's bus is closed still for tours. Ranch driving high octane gift shop. Lightning rod. Now you cannot film on any of the roller coasters, but uh, I do kind of want to ride this one. And then the ride the Rock and Roadway here. It's like a little, like a kind of like a Kennywood Turnpike type thing for those who are familiar with classic Kennywood. If you stop moving while you're still grooving, remain seated and hope will be on the way. Oh, this one's driving like a maniac here. Look at that. Thank you. 
goodness. Very exciting. It is a Tuesday and it is packed here at Dollywood. Now it is the end of July. It's also oppressively hot. So <laughs> It's so hot. Now, the one thing is, is that um, uh, my daughter, who's autistic, has really come out of her shell and rode a lot of rides today, which is awesome. Um, but, you know, so that's, they have a nice mix of cool, fun, like, family-style rides that she digs. You know, really cool so far, but it wasn't for the large amount of people and the heat. I would really dig Dollywood. <laughs> And that's not a knock on Dollywood. There's just a ton of people here, and, and understandably so, and it's very hot. off at Hickory House Barbecue, um, but there is an issue with Dollywood, and if you're coming here late July, August, uh, you're going to run into it, I think. Um, about half of Dollywood's restaurants are currently closed. Food stands are closed, certain restaurants are closed, and it's making the food lines extremely long. We probably waited in this line for about, I don't know, felt like 45 minutes, maybe an hour for just food, for just like quick, like quick service food. Now this is a nice, looks good, like pork, barbecue pork sandwich. And the fries look awesome too. They're like kind of like potato wedge style tater fries. Fries are good. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna make a mess. It's all over my face. Mm. It's really good though. Alright, look, truth be told, I came here for this. I've heard about the Dollywood cinnamon bread, and now I get to try it for myself. Oh, yeah, it's about that time. Cinnamon bread. Different syrup and preserve. This is what we came here for, not the lines, not the heat, not the amount of people, but this, the grist mill cinnamon bread. Tom was here now available in smell vision Smell it. Oh, it smells amazing. And I got two types of dips here. We've got their general icing. Got an apple butter, I think is what it is. Um, they did not have forks, so we are we're gonna knife it here down the middle. And you know we're just gonna pull it apart. What do I what do I care? What do I or just pull it apart. Now, should I try one without the icings just to see the general lay of the land before I get into the icings here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a reason why a lot of people say come to Dollywood for the cinnamon bread. Mmm. Oh my god. It's unbelievable. Alright. Mm. Little icing action. Icing's amazing. Little apple butter action. Now, for, for I'm not a huge apple fan or fruit fan. I mean, look at my face. Um, but the apple butter one's a little bit too apple-y. Tastes like 
dipping it into an apple, which could be a good thing for you, but not necessarily for me with the icing. Mm, that's amazing. There's a duck. Let's see him. Look at those ducks. Oh my goodness. They're amazing themselves, ducks. There's a duck.
Mystery mine looks really cool. Things you do for your kids. Riding a bear. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> Riding a bear. <laughs> Riding a bear. Catching up with this bear here. What's going on here? Jack Graveyard and the old Boot Hill and Tombstone. Free showers and everything. One size fits all. Yeah, I wanted to get to more things, but when you come here with children uh, and a family, <laughs> and it's incredibly hot, and there's a ton of people you're kind of limited in that regard so look i got through a lot of things but there were plenty more things i didn't get to but oh well what are you gonna do but this time a theme park you exit through the gift shop smart well that'll do it from the Dollywood theme park Pigeon Forge Tennessee uh, great park um probably my daughter's favorite park uh, my daughter's autistic and you know sometimes it's tough to get her to ride stuff like we've had hit and mix things in kennywood but she really found her footing here at dollywood today she had a blast in this park um and if it wasn't for the heat and the amount of people that are here um which is not the park's fault i really have nothing bad to say about this park uh the gristmill cinnamon bread was as advertised if not better uh food was good and uh, had a blast of a time. I definitely want to come back in the off season, maybe for the, the October um, Dollywood Halloween, which I hear was really good. Um, kind of missed out on some of the roller coasters today just because of the long lines, but cannot complain about this park. But that'll do it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Click support me on Patreon like John Bailey did. You can do so. Link is in the description below. If you'd like to buy a t-shirt, you can do so. Spreadshirt, as well as links to my eBay store, Facebook page, Instagram, and Clubhouse. But when it comes to Dollywood, I can now say, my name is Tom and I was here. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye, everyone.